Hi, this is Jonathan. Today we're going to feature something from Orange. This is the Orange Terror Stamp.
but then the lovely Miss Janet from Davis Guitar for passing me this pedal for review. All right, we're gonna get go. When I open up the box, I thought this is just like an ordinary pedal. You remember the orange uh, band Gita that I reviewed many videos back? I love that pedal, right? So I thought this was like another iteration of, of an orange pedal, but this is this uh, amp. This is a micro amp. You know, the Terror series from Orange have like, you know, real small, compact size. They are like compact size amps. And these are the Terror series, right? I uh, haven't played on one yet, soon. And this is like a little version of that. <laughs> so this fits into your pedal board and it's an amp by itself. So basically it works like an amp. Um, you have an in and out. You have a effects loop, buffered effects loop. And you also have a headphones slash cap sim out. So you can actually use this as a practice amp in, an, in the quiet of the night right now. Or you can hook this up to your uh, interface, into your door and record right into your door. So with the cap sim, you know, which is, which is really nice, you know. And I've noticed that uh, Orange amps these days have uh, this uh, capability to, to record from line out, you know, from this Orange uh, Super Crush. It has a line out, a XLR out with cap sim. So does this. Um, and I, I find it to be really useful, right? So there is also a speaker out uh, where you can hook it up to a cap. A real cap, you know, and um, basically that's it. You know, an on off switch now. This runs not on a 9 volt battery or a 9 volt power supply, this runs on a 15 volt. You're not mistaken, yeah, 15 volts, uh, 15 volts, 2 amp. And when when I first opened a box, I thought, why do why do they have like an a, a individual power supply, right? You know, they have this power supply that comes with a box, you know, I'm going like. Why why do this pedal need an individual power supply? Because can it run on a 9 volt battery or a 9 volt power supply that everybody uses? So now I found out that this is actually an amp and there is a tube in it. So it has a 12 EX7 tube in it. And I was wondering why are there vents right here? And when I shown my torchlight in, I found out that there's a tube in it. So there's a 12 EX7 tube in it, and that explains the quality of the sound. Now, from the top, you have a foot switch here, which does not activate this pedal. There is an on-off switch here that activates the pedal, the amp, right? So let's call it an amp. So this foot switch controls the two master volume uh, settings here. So you have two, uh, volume one and volume two, and this switches around. So you can have one for your grounder and the other one, uh, rhythm, and then the other one to kick in your solo volume so you can you know boost it up and after that it's really simple you have the shape where you know the orange amp is famous for it's uh, kind of like especially the terror amp because it's real con real compact in size it doesn't have a full like a three band eq so it has a shape so you can kind of like dial in the the, the mid range or the tone that you want you know less mid scoop you know more mids a little bit more highs and stuff like that so you can play around with the with the uh, sound that you like and just set it in and then you have the gain now, like most orange amps, the gain is really responsive, so you can go from um, really quiet, clean kind of in, 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 in this in this micro amp, right? So you can go from real clean to like full out distortion or overdrive, you know, and, and, and that's so cool. So uh, much versatility. Um, I thought that this is programmable, like you know, you have like volume one with a cut down gain, and volume two, you know, once you activate switch which equals to another gain structure. No, it doesn't have that. So it is really uh, quite stripped down, quite basic, you know, quite quite simple. And that's about it, you know, and and the thing I like about it is the tone that I get from here. I can get from real uh, semi-clean to full-blown, you know, overdrive solo kind of sound, blistering kind of sound, if I choose to. And I find it to be really, really uh, versatile in that area. Some of the usage for this Terra stamp is probably in the studio environment where you can stay on your desktop and you can hook up to your interface every time you need an orange kind of distortion or overdrive. Uh, the other one is to incorporate this into your pedal board, you know. So I've seen some pedal boards containing this and um, I'm actually quite curious how they, uh, you know, swap between uh, an overdriven sound with a clean sound. So either they have two or they use this as a effects pedal. 
you know. So you can actually use this as an effects pedal if you choose to, but that would mean that you will have additional power supply plus your 9 volt power supply. So if you're ready to go for that, or you have a power supply system that you know that can supply two solar voltage from 9 volt to 15, I mean that's cool. And then you can incorporate this as a pedal. Uh, all in all, I find this uh, pedal to be useful in, the, in in my situation at home. So you can use this as a practice amp. It's really cool because the headphone sound is the same, uh, kept same out too. So you can actually play to your heart's content. And the best part is that you have the effects loop. You can hook up your your favorite delay or reverb pedal, and you're good to go. So let me know what you think about this Terra stem and leave a comment in the comment section down below. I'm gonna put a price down here. Now the unit is available in Davis Guitar in Singapore. So if you're in Singapore, check them out, right? And uh, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. Press that bell for notification of future videos and be part of Patreons to support this channel. I would appreciate it. I want to thank all my Patreons for the love and friendship. Thank you guys. So in the meantime, you guys please stay safe, keep warm, and take care of yourself. Ciao.